Welcome to the demo of Chasing Static, a psychological horror short story. Explore the untouched wilderness of rural Wales as you uncover the forgotten remains of a mysterious facility and find the truth behind the missing villages of Hearth. Okay, look around. We're in our car now. Oh, nice. Headlights. Oh, don't turn them off. That's probably not a good idea. What else can we play with? <laughs> grab the gear stick. Okay. Oh, let's have a look at the road. Let's see what happens when we grab the gear stick. Is that how we go faster? Oh, coffee. Nice. Let's have a drink. What do we have now? A glove box. A road map. Is that where we're going? Welcome to the town of Hearth. Whoa. Take our phone. Yeah, let's take the mobile phone. The battery's dead. Ah, that's not good. Okay, let's go. Let's see if we can have some food in this diner. Use the WAST, okay, and shift to run. Okay, very good. Do we have anything in the boot? Old reliable. Gotta love the old reliables. Check out this place. It's a pretty old diner in the middle of nowhere. Christ alive. You almost gave me a heart attack. Let me guess. Got lost in the storm. Oh, look at that. We have options to talk. That's brilliant. Sorry to barge in. Uh, you're still open, right? Uh, kitchen's closed, but we have all the coffee you could want. You don't sound like you're from around here. No. I mean, I used to be. Long time ago. Where are you headed, anyway? I'm, uh, headed east, Oswestry. Oh, so do you want the good news or the bad news first? Whoa, okay, what's the bad news? Ah, uh, okay, go on, hit me with the bad news first. Fearless, I like it. Well, you missed the turning, it's like half an hour back the way you came. Good news is, I know the way. We'll be headed that way myself soon, anyway. Hang about and I'll show you the way, if I can bum a lift. Absolutely. Sure. Uh, to be honest, I can do with the company. Oh, must be Wasn't her bicycle outside. In this rain, anyway. Yeah. Nothing creepy, though. I'll kick your ass if you try anything. <laughs> hey, I'm just relieved to be off that road. Where are we, anyway? Welcome to the Last Stop Cafe. Best coffee this side of the A5. Don't get a lot of customers these days, though. Oh, yeah, help yourself to coffee. I'll be done in five. I love this. So, I don't know if that's done by one death or something, but it's uh, obviously an indie so game. I never caught your name. Oh, okay, oh, so Chris. we have a casual conversation. Okay. Chris, right. Nice and simple. But I love it, it's really well yeah. done. Let's take a cup. It was my dad's name. My grandfather too. My parents weren't exactly ones to break tradition. Well, it's nice to meet you, Chris. I'm Aneira. I used to know someone called Aneira. It means winter, right? Close. Winter is Giaf. Aneira translates to snow. 
Oh, my Welsh is a little rusty. Hey, I'm impressed. I love this. You can interact with the machine. That's brilliant. Well, neither can I, apparently. So what brings you to this neck of the woods? I... Um, well, I buried my dad today. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. Oh, it's fine. We didn't uh, exactly see eye to eye. Yeah, my dad left when I was six. Turned up ten years later wanting to play Happy Family. This is really I still well get done. Calls from him. Not that I ever answer. Family, eh? I'll be finished up soon. Then we can hit the road. Oh, could you deal with that? Just mess with the dial until it finds a signal again. Okay. Whoa. Again, that's a second time this week. Hold on, I've got a lighter here somewhere. Press tab to open your inventory. Objective, restore power to the inn. Okay. We have two items. We have a road map. Oh, my father's journal. Actually, let's see what that is about. I didn't even check that out. To omit my concern, packed into the pages of this book, you will find my life's work, a means with no end, a fruitless garden. Thirty years of questions with no answers. I fear that these questions juxtaposed with concepts so foreign they can drive a man insane. We'll never find the answers. Much like my own hollow ambitions, some things never come to fruition. I only hope that these tattered pages may serve to prove that we are more than ourselves and that our perception of reality is merely a veil over our own ideals and hunger to understand this world. I have many regrets. The garden is not one of them. So it sounds like his dad was part of a research team. So he was a scientist, I guess. And his research team that he was heading was going off to his side um, in the marshlands in northern Wales. Okay, it seems that there was some incidents happening where people lost their lives, so people actually died. And then there was a second incident. Only after the second incident, the... Um, people obviously that supplied them um, the facilities sent them fresh supplies and the dad noticed that the water was tasting different and he found out that it was laced with lithium okay this is getting a bit creepy now so they were obviously in hearth it seems and he's saying that hearth was like a time capsule so a lot of people seem to have died there and this is where the scientists were and the team the, the research team had a lot of sightings there so what were they looking for exactly they seem to be looking for things called echoes so maybe something to do with ghosts or spirits, I have no idea, but they had them divided into three sites. The B site, um, a couple of echoes they found there, and nothing too amazing, but then the Alpha site is the one where they said was the most busiest, was the most echoes, which was like uh, the busiest cafe at the, at the side road. And then site C, which I called Ground Zero, was like a huge crater, 18 feet wide, everything around it dead, uh, skeletons of dead trees. Um, and then uh, saying here is the celestial substance had been moved, of course, long since secured in a facility. So they actually got something from there. But the anomalies are growing. This is getting really weird. So what he called the garden in the beginning of his journal is the Echo Garden. And this is where they kept the anomaly to study it. And that's it. That's where the journal ends. No more entries. So what is the anomaly all about? And what did they find? What happened to all of the scientists? Anyway, let's take out the lighter. See, this is why I love smokers. <laughs> you wouldn't mind taking a look, would you? Ah, Here's sure. Boxes in the back. Yeah, let's go to creepy areas. Uh, okay, I guess. Last time I was waiting four hours. Great. So, what am I looking for here? There's a fuse box in the kitchen. Um, kitchen. Okay. Right. Well, we might as well check the bathroom for completeness. Just in case we find any items there, anything useful. Newspaper that tells us it's the year 200. No, something like that. We traveled back in time. Okay. Oh, there you go. There's a fuse box. Lights only. Okay, so it's the... Okay, this is the lights. Let's see what's happening. Examine the hey, fuse Neira, box. Hey, Neira, a bunch of these fuses are fried. 
There should be some spare fuses somewhere. Okay, let's have a look around. Oh, we can open the drawers. Sweet. Oh, Genie Mac. Screwdriver has been added to your inventory. Nice, I like it. There was nothing in here that we could pick up. No, okay. Like a knife to defend ourselves. Can we cr uh, kneel, crawl, XC? No, okay. There are no fuses here. Oh, this is jammed. I was just about to say, let's use the screwdriver? Nice, here we go. Electrical fuse has been added to the inventory. Okay, let's head over here. Let's put the fuse in. Um, second fuse, pick up, examine, examine. So if this is for the lights, then I'm assuming we're gonna have to take this one out. And the fuse is dead. And put this fuse in. Okay. And turn on. How do we... T is everything back on? Looks like. Nah, it's dead. Oh, okay. Dead. They're all dead. Hang on. Oh, this one is working. So if all we care about is the lights, then we're just going to put that into the last slot. Excellent, look at that. Hey, uh, no need to thank me or anything. Anera? Oh no, where's she gone? Don't leave me alone in this creepy coffee place. What the, ah! what the hell? Okay, what the hell is going on? Why was she hugging the ceiling? What is going on? What is this place? This place looks like nobody has been in here for years. Okay. I have no intention to go in the woods. So how about we're gonna go to our car? drive home and just forget that any of this ever happened okay let's take out our lighter if we can cassette tape player what oh my balls the journal is this the site the coffee is this so did we just Oh my god, is this like where you come into a place, it all looks like normal, and actually it's all... This is what it actually looks like, and this is the site that my dad was talking about in the journal, and these are the instruments to measure whatever anomalies they're talking about? So I just had a conversation with a ghost? Well, let's leave this place, get into the car, and skedaddle. Yeah, I'm out of here. But the bicycle is still there. Oh. Well, it says don't go into the woods, so I think we should just listen. Okay, where are we driving to now? Let's take my mobile phone. Battery's dead, is it? Still? Yeah. Oh! Well, it says don't go into the woods, and of course our car crashes in the woods. Lucky to be alive. Well, let's head up to the main road and see if we can uh, stop a car for help. Oh, I can't get further up. It won't. It won't let me leave the woods. No, I literally am forced to go into the woods. There's a light over there. And there's nothing over there. Just water, it seems, or whatever that is. So, yeah, sure. 
Let's head this way. <laughs> oh, I love it. Don't head to the woods, but the only way you can go is through the woods. Let's go for a little casual jog and see what the light is. Oh, glowing mushrooms. Nice. All right, let's go. Ah! Dude. What's with the noises? And why is there... Oh, no. There's another one of those weird science machines. Nah, let's follow the path, I guess. Okay, there's a structure. That's good. So we might be able to call for help. Crossroads. Great. Well, this looks creepy. This looks creepy. So let's take the creepy road. Why not? Go left around. Okay, that goes to the water. Is there anything here? Like a boat? Can we escape? Can, can we just swim away? Okay, so we're gonna be forced to go the other way. So that, yeah, that roadside cafe, definitely the one that we were to, uh, that the journal mentioned. Well, there's a bird, so which means it's not too spooky. If if nature is alive, then it's okay. Oh. Are you joking me? You are kidding me. At least we came back to the main road. I suppose the best way now is to actually just walk on the main road, I guess. That's what I would do myself now. Walk on the main road until you see a car stop. Oh. No! There is no escape. There is no escape. This is the coffee shop. Oh my god, we're in circles. What is if we go this way? We're just gonna walk this way now. We're gonna, we're gonna... Oh no. Hang on. And there's the coffee shop again. Are you joking? Well, it looks like the only thing we can do is go back into the woods. I mean, I'm gonna have a quick look around here again just to make sure I didn't miss anything. And there's no other way of getting into the woods here. So the only way is to go back on the path. All right. We gotta do what we gotta do. Oh, we can actually go into the woods. Okay. What is that over there? There's like a blue light. Let's have a look over there. It's like a building of some sort. Ah! What the hell? Why is the door closing? Can we pick up any of those leaflets? There's a hex hexagonal fixture in the center of the door. Okay, we certainly have to find something to open it with. Okay, let's do it. Let's go this way. Let's see if we can find anything. Okay, there's another hood over here. Oh no. Hello? Oh god. Oh, that smell. Sir? Please be dead and don't move. Oh yes, we found the rusty valve. Thank you, I take this, thank you. A discarded note. Date, 1998, time, 237, researcher, Dr. Nisha Baines. Is that the body that is there? Full range, strong displacement, singular source, clear audible chatter, further study advice. So she was, there was the echoes then, I guess. Uh, moderate displacement, singular source, audible chatter, multiple entries. Okay, that's it. Weak displacement, singular structure, okay. Strong, moderate, and weak. So it got weaker 
So what is all that 94 to 94.9, 95, is that frequencies or something? Oh, the mushrooms are spread over his body or her body, ah. Okay, let's go back to the bunker entrance. Let's see if that valve works. Well, beats the rain. Chasing static. This looks amazing. I'm really enjoying this. I love the old style that the game is made in and the voice acting is actually pretty good. I, I definitely, yeah, I will definitely be playing this when this comes out. This is absolutely fantastic. Let me know what you think in the comments. I'm a really fan of these old style games. It's very silent hilly in a lot of ways. Uh, just the atmosphere, the way it's done, and um, really, really enjoying it so far. Anyway, I hope you guys had a good time with the video. If you did, remember to kick that like button in the balls, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. And if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, hit that subscribe button. I'll see you guys next time. Until then, as always, viel Spaß and happy gaming.